Many think that when parking in front of a meter, it's as simple as pulling up and paying a fee. But what you may not realize is that if your fender is not aligned with the meter, it's still possible to get a ticket even after you've paid. Ride sharing apps like Uber and Lyft can be convenient, but riders must always take precaution. Just one simple recipe from her grandmother paved the way for her growing business. Like most, you may wait until alerted to prepare for hurricane season. But to be safe, you must act fast and think ahead before it's too late. Hi, are you Danielle? Ride sharing services like Uber and Lyft have become one of the most convenient options when using public transportation allowing a driver to pick you up from your exact location by using an app on your cell phone. Um, so I'll pull up, I'll text them, hey, I'm outside. Um, if I don't see them, I'll give them a call or a text, and it's from um, a number that's made up by Lyft. They don't actually get your personal number, you don't get their personal number. While waiting on your driver, the app gives you the exact details you should look for to ensure that you are getting in the correct vehicle. It'll give you the make, model, um, year of the vehicle of the person who's picking you up and there should be a profile picture up to date of the person who's picking you up as well. Using Uber and Lyft are great transportation options when in downtown areas or even clubs and bars, but even that can be dangerous. I think it's safe for everyone to use, but it's like you always have to watch your back. Ride sharing apps like Uber and Lyft can be convenient, but riders must always take precaution. If you're traveling alone, then maybe try to do Uber Pool or the Lyft group ride where you're going to be riding with multiple people. With Louisiana Focus, I'm Danielle Johnson. Just one simple recipe from her grandmother paved the way for her growing business. Dominique DeFillo had no idea that her normal hair and skincare routine would turn out to be something that everyone wanted in on. And it pretty much started. Um, because I was making my own products for two or three years now and then one day I was just like let me put it on my blog and I have my own separate blog so I started doing that and then people started hitting me up saying you know hey like I want to try what you use for your skin. Named after her late grandmother there is no doubt that Dominique was highly influenced. And then I named it after my grandma because she always grew up teaching us like aloe vera plants can heal everything, you know, it can save your hair, it can save your skin, and she never wore makeup, she had no wrinkles, and she was like 80 years old. The time it takes to create, package, and ship the product can take almost a full day to complete the work. It'll at least take me to do everything at least five hours because you have to make the products. I usually have at least 10 orders, like at the very minimum, and then you have to, you know, prepare the labels, which is like the longest part. So uh, after everything's done, you get them packaged and everything, it's at least five. But I've been up, you know, 10 hours doing straight products. Outside of creating her own product, Dominique also pushes Letha Organics through social media and collaborating with other businesses. I'm definitely pushing through marketing, social media. Uh, I'm starting to expand a little more in going to businesses and trying to do like collaborations and things like that. But social media is like the end all be all for everything because there's so much out there and so many people follow me specifically on social media so it kind of helps. But um, I'm definitely trying to kind of venture more into the business world because this is kind of like the small scheme and I know I'm growing really fast so preparing to like you know start linking and doing collabs with other uh, businesses and things like that. The journey to healthy hair and glowing skin is just one click away. Reporting News, Danielle Johnson.